Hey everybody, it's Bill Hunt here. I'm coming to you from Lebanon, Pennsylvania. I'm here at the Walmart, which used to be uh, years ago, back in the 70s and 80s, it was the Key Drive-In uh, movie, Key Drive-In movie theater. And I spent many and many a weekend night here watching a lot of great movies. This is where my love of drive-ins began. It was the first drive-in theater I ever went to. Um, as you can see, it's now a Walmart, which is really sad. Uh, a lot of the drive-ins are going away, and I really miss this one particularly. Um, a lot of great times here. I remember, uh, in particular, one Sunday, I'm sure it happened more than once, but I remember one time in particular coming to the drive-in with my mom to see a movie after uh, Saturday afternoon of roller skating which was at the casino, the casino roller skating rink, uh, one of my favorite places to be. And a lot of those experiences at the drive-in or at the skating rink influenced a lot of the music I wrote later on. I also remember uh, listening to a lot of Aria Speedwagon cassettes when I was on my way here to the drive-in. Uh, that was one of my favorite bands. Uh, in the early 80s, like around 1981, 82, Aria Speedwagon was one of my favorite bands. And that leads me into the song that we're going to be talking about today. The song we're going to be talking about today is called Someday. Uh, before I do get into that, though, I want to thank you all again for checking out my YouTube channel. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Um, I'd like to apologize for it taking so long to update my, my videos. Uh, it took me a long time to find this song. I thought that I had played this song a lot more in Runaway Train than I actually did. It was only the last couple shows that we had actually played this song. The last maybe four or five shows. Before that we didn't play it. And uh, the song Someday was written at the tail end of Cry Wolf. Um, I do remember it being written and performed before... Runaway Train and Baby You Are The One but I couldn't find any uh, concert footage of Cry Wolf playing that song at all so you know maybe it was written after I just don't remember that clearly but I do know that Cry Wolf did perform someday it was at the end of the band probably the last show or two and then uh, the Boardwalk Nights I don't believe played it but Runaway Train and it's one of its last versions did play it at the last three or four shows of that band. Uh, the song was performed not with drums and bass, but just as a solo thing. Uh, the, the drummer would do his drum solo, the guitar player would do his guitar solo, and then I would come out and play guitar and sing this song. Uh, Some Days always, was always one of my favorite songs. And I say that for most of these songs, but Someday really is in like my top 15 songs I've ever written. It just has such a fun, uh, relaxed, mellow groove to it. Um, a little bit earlier I brought up Aria Speedwagon being one of my favorite bands. Well, they were a major influence for the song Someday. Uh, a song particularly called Only a Summer Love, uh, which is about a major summer romance um, that didn't last very long uh, but it was very powerful something that you remember and I love that Aria Speedwagon song so much listen to it a lot driving to the drive-in um, so I wanted to write a song like that and that's what Someday is it's all about a summer romance and how it sticks with you and stays on your mind um, I actually, it's kind of like a trilogy. I wrote three songs about that same topic. Uh, Someday was the first of the three. The second one was, uh, uh, the second song from that would be Summer Girl. And the third would be With a Whisper, Not a Scream. Those three songs were all written about uh, summer romance kind of thing. Um, the song is just so nice. Uh, just about my favorite line from the song is I wave my hand but couldn't say goodbye which is definitely inspired by that uh, Aria Speedwagon song Only a Summer Summer Love um, 
great song and I, I really miss playing this one. I, I'll probably bring this back to, to my solo shows. Uh, great tune and I hope you enjoy it. The version you're going to hear uh, of this song was done by the second last version of Runaway Train and it was one of our last shows. Uh, one, of, one of the two best shows Runaway Train ever did in my opinion and that was at the Roller Roost, one of our favorite places to play. Uh, the light show was always spectacular there and the crowd was amazing. I really loved playing the Roller Roost in Pottsville. It was a skating rink um, and as you know going to the casino was a major thing for me growing up in the, the 80s, late 70s, early 80s. Uh, I spent almost every weekend there when I was a teenager uh, roller skating. So getting to play at the Roller Roost Three or four times I played there with Runaway Train was just amazing for me, uh, being able to play a concert while while uh, people were skating. So anyway, I hope you really enjoy this. Uh, the song is called Someday, as performed by Runaway Train. And again, my name is Bill Hunt, and thank you for checking out the videos. And I will see you again real soon. And God bless you all.